All right, ladies, gents, boys, fans, girls of all ages, we're back for some more Tiberium Sun one-on-one -on -one action. It's a rematch between Tiger and Trooper. Um, they're swap sides. We're gonna have Trooper top left versus Tiger bottom right. Game two. Standard opening from both. Power barracks. Inf. We've got three spectrate spectators in the game. Hopefully it's not too laggy, especially with me recording. Uh, Tiger is aware that I'm recording. Trooper is not. Trooper's birthday is today, so happy birthday, Troop. Uh, hopefully you get this win. I don't think Tiger is going to go easy on you, but we should see for what's going to happen. Um, I would really love to have some background music during this game, but uh, unfortunately I am not computer savvy enough to, uh, to figure out how to do so without messing up the refinery. Um, top left, opening up one refinery, Harvester Radar, bottom right, it's got the early jump jet scout going two or three ref, looks like top left is going to one ref in from the top left. Top left needs to focus on staying on scouted and build quickly, uh, so you can use that element of surprise. And bottom right uh, is going to, well, have to uh, anticipate that maybe top left may be rushing. He is going to find out right now. There are two jump jets just cross path. Bottom right's alarm, you know, is just going to get triggered, and he's going to be like, "Oh, well, I see that you are now rushing." I am going to build some defense. So it's going to be about speed. This first attack is going to be huge for top left. This disruptor is going to make or break the change of the game. Bottom right harassing the power plant. Top left has got the disruptor. Service pad. Carry all building. The disruptor building. Bottom right is, is scouted. Uh, he's going to component tower. He's using he's going to use the sand and his infantry uh, to stop the disruptor. Top left is going to have to deal with this jump jet that's harassing the power plant. He's not building anything. He is focused on this disruptor. Yikes. Right now we have an interesting game. Uh, so top left went basically all in on that disruptor. Uh, went for that that construction yard, but Tiger did a good job of defending it with um, his infantry and engineer. Top left is now going to be behind uh, on the economy, so he's going to have to catch up. Bottom right. Um, he's now building a war factory. He's going to be teching up instead. Uh, spectator here made a comment that top left should have gone for bottom right refineries. Um, yeah, you could argue that, yeah, sure, that would have been a safe play. Uh, he probably might have been able to get one, if not two, refineries. Um, but then you could also argue that, you know, going for the kill move, the construction yard, um, could have been, it could have gone either way. Um, he, if you notice, when he used that disruptor, he did cue backwards and then was at a at an odd angle for that one shot. So if you if you disruptor from these side angles here, you actually do more damage to the construction yard than you do if you're slightly offset. So if you are going to be you know trying to one shot the disruptor on a construction yard and you do end up cueing your disruptor, um, try to maintain that line that angle of attack uh, to maximize the damage from the disruptor. Otherwise, you're going to be Less damage than that disruptor. So, then right here, going for the refinery. He's keeping the pressure up. It's the right move. Um, while building up his eco, he's throwing in the towel, saying GG. And that is. Okay, he's not surrendering. Yay. Alright, this sucks. I've been in this situation where your disruptor fails. But, um, and now you're 
pretty much planned from behind, but getting that one refinery is going to help um, a lot. The key is when you do a, a one rep, you know, build like that, and you get scouted, um, you really, really, really have to make sure that you don't waste that disruptor. So it could have gone either way in this case. You could have got that construction yard. He would have looked like the hero, and he would have won. Or the safe play to go for the refineries um, and to, to slow your opponent while building up back of your own. Either way is the right move. Um, obviously, you don't want to waste your disruptor, but uh, you know, it's, it's hard. It's easy to like, quarterback while you're watching and just up here, defending against the infantry, using the Titans to squish on the bottom right, patiently holding this disruptor back, top left, lost one Titan in the process, but two RPGs and an MLR for, to use as a mobile sand, top bottom right, uh, not using his disruptor, holding it back, building a mammoth, um, has got a nice economy of himself. Top left is going to have to get some more refineries out. Um, and then he should be okay, even though he is behind. Bottom right, making the mammy. Top left. Nice. That was an excellent placement of that power plant right underneath that disruptor saved his refinery minimum defense bought him some more time tiger aggressively expanding out he's got the mammoth in place he's coming to do some harassment top left still building refineries trying to catch up he's gonna have to rely on this one mlr for his only anti-air defense, bottom right, healing his disruptor. We're going to have some harvester harassment going up here. Bottom left, is, or top left, has run out of his main Tiberium. And his harvesters are getting harassed. He's going to hit that, that wall here for a second. Oh, he loses his, his anti-air. Bottom right is just going to have... So much time to harass these harvesters. Top left is feeling the effects. And is broke. Charge the strapper coming back into play. Harvester harassment. Refinery. Saves the refinery. Loses a power plant. Kills the disruptor. Doesn't lose any harps. So that. And the mammoth is, is damaged. Bottom right, expanding out. Top left, there you go. Throws down a Sam. That should stop the MK harassment. Even though that slowed him, um, that that didn't really hurt him that badly. He's His, his harps were, are still able to harvest. He's going to get that money coming in. He's going to be able to expand out now. Um, bottom right is most likely going to use this, that advantage, to. Go ahead and build to the middle, um, secure even a, a third expansion, bottom left. Top left is now going to secure, oh, okay, he's, he's building. Is he going to expand or delay down another refinery? Let's see. Throwing down some SAMs. Building a mammoth. Uh, throwing some defenses out. So bottom right is ahead. However, top left is going to have a nice little steady stream of income coming in if he keeps expanding out. So this is still anybody's game. Bottom right needs to press his, keep his advantage. Not many make any mistakes. You should be able to get to the middle and secure that fourth, that third Tiberian patch. Mammoth comes in. Gets the comp tower. Hidden Sands paying dividends. Bottom right is going to lose his 
mammoth. Top left is going to lose two power plants and that hidden sand. However, most importantly, bottom right lost that mammoth. That is going to buy top left some time to pull himself back into the game. Um, again, remember, top left did a, started with a one refinery disruptor rush and it failed. So he's going to be struggling to bounce back economically the whole game. Last thing he wants to do is lose his mammoth, and I think he doesn't care. Yep. GG. Player was defeated.